Hello, we're back. Part 2 of the PS2 collection. I have a lot, so it's gonna take a few videos. And here's the game that we finished up taking a walk through. Crash Twin Tennis. I finished up the walkthrough, and you're gonna see more Resident 5 walkthroughs soon. As you may have noticed, I already put up three more parts. Alright? So you got that. The Adventures of The Grim Adventures of Billy and Mandy. Mostly a fight that concludes to a story. If you don't play any of the main characters on here, like Billy, Mandy, and Grim, then you're gonna go off to a different set of stories if you play a different character at a time. Are the red twilight of spirit? I'm s I can't believe I haven't beat it yet. I'm stuck on a part that I can't seem to successfully beat. What is this? Ah, uh, Ratchet and Clank, up your arsenal. This was an awesome game to play with its new kind of way of aiming weapons. Better weapons, and the story threw me, well, it didn't threw me off, but awesome, so, better move on to this one. It's Chronicles of Narnia, guys. It was, it was the greatest game I played, and slightly using cheap. Look at all I did. Alright, Spyro, enter the dragonfly. Yeah, this game is hard to beat. Beat it though, but hard to beat. If you're a choice. Alright, let's see. Oh, Kingdom Hearts, the first game. I finally beat it. Got level 100 and the ultimate Keyblade, which was an epic way to end the game. Yep, awesome way. Too bad I don't have to get to reset the story with all my levels up in a challenge mode. Naruto Zukumaki Chronicles. Yep. It was a good game. Hard to beat though. But past it. Hard to understand a little bit. Oh crap. It's good. Yeah. Gungrave. The very first PS2 game I ever played. Awesome. And I started out the game with unlimited rockets and machine gun ammo and stuff for some reason. Either my sister looked it up. Saying that sometimes if you play a new game, you get alerted. Yeah. Here's another Resident Evil front person view game. Resident Evil Dead Aim. Yeah. I don't fully understand how this concludes to the Resident Evil series. But it's a good game using Guncom from person view. For those people who think this game sucks. Don't ask. Ratchet Deadlock. My favorite dead I mean my favorite ratchet game that I ever played. I like their weapons and how their and how the storyline goes. Ratchet and Clank were off on a mission or a Then all of a sudden some someone crashes into their ship and takes them away to play the Deadly game, and they try to fight their way out alive. Watch that. Ah, uh, here's the first. Now here's the second of Ratchet and Clank. Ratchet and Clank going commando. Awesome. 
replayable story challenge mode, just like the other raccoon coins. Yeah, the game. The most annoying game I ever played. Finding Nemo. I'm starting to think it's a baby game. Played it. Hard to beat. Like I was that with the other game. And such. So I don't recommend for you guys to get this game. Sonic Riders. Yep. Awesome game and stuff. It's a good game. Riding with all this stuff. Actually seeing how like other things happen. I don't know, so just please go with it. Sonic Heroes. Yep. Sonic Heroes. A three person thing where you all play three different people at a time. Collecting Chaos Emeralds a lot, the secret story. Yeah. Good game. Okay. In my previous video, I mentioned something about Metal Gear Solid 3 Snake Eater. This is Substance. Two disc. Oh, sorry. With with the other game that lets you play online with other players. Sing Star Rock. It's an awesome singing game that I like the most. Lost the controls somehow. So yeah, that's that. And now I'm ending this video and I still need to make another one for the next for the next collection.